this is a conference about being Christ-led in our ministry. And we are dealing with lives that are broken by addiction, and there's a lot of elements that are mixed into that. But let us never forget that it must be Christ-led in order to be effective. There is a theme in our country, and the theme is things are not getting better. Things are steadily, progressively getting better, and all of the numbers back that up. Government and often even our, our, our churches are at a loss about what to do concerning the addiction and concerning people who are bound. Uh, by addiction. I sit down with an addict and I take my Bible out and I say, drink this, shoot this, smoke this. You've tried everything else, fool. Why don't you try this and see what Jesus can do for you? I'm not interested in getting you off drugs. I'm interested in, in hanging out with you in the next life. One of the things that benefited most, I love hearing the passion about how we help uh, the drug epidemic that we have as pastors. I uh, got a hold of some resources that are going to be very beneficial to me uh, as far as helping those that come to our church. And uh, so I was really blessed today. Scientists have not really identified a specific gene, a addiction gene. And we win a battle one high five at a time. It used to be that you could say we change the world one person at a time. That isn't even accurate anymore. You want to know who we are? We are people that are passionate that have actually experienced what it's like to be on the front lines when a life is saved. So drug addiction is a ever-growing, far-reaching monster that uh, affects our community on just about every level. And so uh, the best way to combat that is to equip and educate the community itself. And I feel like that's what Mission Driven's goal was, and that's what uh, Mission Driven accomplished. We just need Jesus, amen? And, and we need more people like you spending days like today where you say, I care, you know, I care enough.